Hello everyone, and welcome to Power Pages Tips. My name is Nicholas Hayduk, and this is tip number 234. Trigger Cloudflow via Web API. An often requested feature of Power Pages is an out-of-the-box integration with Power Automate. For years, Power Pages has worked with classic workflows, but with so many cool features and connectors available in Power Automate, many people have asked for cloud flows to be supported as well. The good news is that the first step in that direction has been taken. Developers can now call Power Automate cloud flows via the Power Pages web API. To do this, first create a cloud flow using the new when Power Pages calls a flow trigger. As part of this trigger, you can define parameters that can be passed in. After the trigger step, you can do any of the regular magic that is possible with Power Automate. To invoke the Cloudflow, first enable it for Power Pages in the Design Studio by going to the Setup Workspace, and then go to the Cloudflows page in the Integrations area. Add your Cloudflow and select which web roles are required for users to be able to call it. Once that is done, you'll get the Web API URL to invoke via a post. If you've defined parameters in your trigger, pass those in in the body of the request. If your Cloudflow has a response action, you'll get the data back in the response body. I'm hopeful that we'll see even more integration with Power Automate, like being able to invoke a Cloudflow from a list or a form, like we can with classic workflows. But for now, being able to do it via the Web API is a great first step. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Power Pages tip number 234 on Trigger Cloudflow via Web API useful.